What's up? Can a low come up in your crib? Man, fuck you. I see you at work. Oh, nigga, don't hate me because I'm beautiful, nigga. Maybe if you got rid of that old yee-yee ass haircut you got, you'd get some bitches on your dick. Started with 141 subscribers, okay? I just gained another subscriber. I just gained another subscriber! We meet here because you want to know how to create god tier, top quality, hilarious gaming videos on YouTube, right? Wrong! You want to create the funniest video you've ever seen in your entire life. You want to make one video and blow up from that one video. You want it to be so it just draws people and people don't even have computers. Unfortunately, you're not going to find that here, but I will show you how to make a decent video game gaming video that is slightly funny i want to start off by saying everyone's first few videos are going to be cringy okay they're going to be awkward they're going to be poorly edited there are going to be audio and sound and lighting issues it's just gonna happen nobody's first video is going to be god tier it's just going to be below basic average you're probably wondering what do i have to offer i don't even have any subscribers well let me tell you even though I don't have any subscribers, I feel like I pretty much get the grasp of how to grow on YouTube. I'm just, my problem is I don't upload enough. <laughs> New subscriber, Jack Nasty. Thank you so much, Jack Nasty. We love your videos. He's great. So the very first step to making a YouTube channel is having a personality. Honestly, if you don't have a personality, good luck on YouTube. You have to have a personality, you have to be funny, you have to be uplifting people have to want to watch you you have to be entertaining okay if you're dull if you're boring you can still make it but not so likely but that's my personal opinion and i think that's a little true where do i even begin i make probably the best videos on youtube that i have ever seen i think that i'm the best obviously you guys probably aren't going to take much advice from somebody that's 143 subscribers but listen here Assuming you've already got a PC that turns on and works, and assuming that you have all of the peripherals, the only thing you really need to capture gameplay and edit is OBS, which is what I use. You can use other things, but I mean, I use OBS, and you're gonna need Premiere Pro because that is what this tutorial is based off of. So the number one thing you start with when you're making YouTube videos, let me tell you, you're gonna wanna have organization. Okay, this is what I do. So I do this not good okay so my organization is all over the place i have stuff on my solid state drive which is where these current videos are and then i also have stuff on my hard drive because my hard drive is a little bigger so i'm starting to send my videos over there don't do that have one dedicated space where all your videos can go and have a dedicated folder. i'm going to show you right now like for example this is what i do so i would make a folder and i'm going to call this folder how to create God, God tier, funny YouTube videos. That's what you do. That's okay. So you're gonna make a folder and you're gonna put all your videos in here, okay? They're gonna go right here. You just move them, you put them in that folder. Easy peasy. Like I said, you're also gonna want to have some audio clips just to save some time. You're gonna wanna go get some audio clips before you ever even start recording, okay? You're gonna go, I got all these from the YouTube audio section. They're free. You just download them. I have sound effects. I have music. I have just about everything. One tip, have this. This is the bleep out your swear words. I'm just gonna tell you, just download that right now. We're gonna start a new project. Name the project something great. I've labeled mine tutorial. You're gonna go back to that folder. I have mine stayed in my hard drive. Go to the folder. You're gonna pull all the videos in this folder. There are no videos, but you're gonna pull them. Then you're gonna drag them and you're gonna place them in here. This is an example of a finished project, okay? You see all this on? This is God tier. But I go through my videos about three times, okay? Not the first time. You're removing any dull, boring, silent, or just completely unentertaining sections of the video, which is probably about 75% of the video, honestly. There cannot be a second of bore. I'm telling you, people will click away. Okay. Personally, when I'm looking for a video, if I click around that video and nothing's happening, I'm switching off that video immediately. If it's boring, if it's stupid, if you're not laughing while you're watching it, fuck it. So I do have a couple of tips and tricks to give you guys on how I edit very quickly to save a little bit of time. As you see here, I have some green things. I will label potential introduction videos 
this green color. So anything that I think is like the funniest part of the videos, I will label in green. And those are the things that I will potentially put in the intro. People's attention spans are very short nowadays. You can think TikTok. People want to be continuously stimulated or they click away, they're uninterested. The first 30 seconds of your video better be the best of that video or it just ain't gonna cut it. Tell your mama, Leon tone. Here's gonna be a fiery <gasps> No! <laughs> Zoom. Is that a burrito? Okay, at this point, what's going on? I think it'll be very safe. He bit the out of me. Motherfucker bit me. Motherfucker fought me. I threw one in there checking that motherfucker. He got fought me. Motherfucker. I need some water. Did you see that? I thought that was a top tier introduction. Let me tell you. There was zoom ins, there was funny text. There was constantly something going on in the first 30 seconds showcased what the rest of the video is going to be like. Did you notice? Not any moment of that was too drawn out. Every, all of the frames were very short. I constantly skipped to the next one. A person wasn't lingering in a moment for too long. There was constantly a new stimulation happening, a new scene, a new something. I was zooming in, I had text. Do you see what I'm saying? Now, another thing I'd like to mention is people like familiarity. Familiarity. People like familiarity. I start the intro to every single one of my videos the same. I have my 30 second intro to what the video is gonna be about. Then I do my, hey mother welcome back to my channel, welcome to my channel. If you're new, I always say mother every single thing. I have catchphrases that I say every single video. I just have things that I do repeatedly every single video that like, you know, they like connecting, they like seeing familiar things. And when you do that, I feel like it builds a sense of community with your viewers. Listen, with my videos, at any second that you stop the video, something is going on. You mother I don't know what them plugs are for then. Mother fuck me, I threw one in there checking that mother He got fuck. Um, ooh. Hey. No! What? Oh, I already know. Oh, oh, this is spooky. Here I go again on my own Going down the only road I've ever known I'm crawling my way out of here Oh my god, he ruins every moment <gasps> Burn her, there's a pig! <gasps> yeah! No! Now do you see what I'm talking about? At any moment, if you click on any section of this game, Your something's happening screen. Whatever the fuck that means There's a zoom in, there's funny text Open on the thing Something's happening, there's a cutscene, something. At every moment of the video. <gasps> yeah! No! To make a good gaming video is to not have any dead time or dead space in your videos. I think that is the number one most important thing. That bitch and video needs to be entertaining from start to finish every moment. Every clip that somebody clicks on needs to have something going on. I think that's the most important thing to making a decent quality video. His brain! His brains! So honestly, I think that sums up how to make fantastic, wonderful video. Also, look at my thumbnail. Or my whatever this is. That's actually me. That's me when I bang the dirt myself. It's wonderful. It's quite here. It stands out. 